there's many many ways of making macaroni and cheese just like chicken many many ways of making chicken i have a few chicken on the channel too and i'm gonna update and make more 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 chicken so macaroni and cheese you can make it in every lot of different ways so i'll show you and this is one of the ways i'm gonna show you how to make your mac and cheese and you can have it any occasion you can have it any day of the week you can have it for christmas thanksgiving and now it's going on to christmas so I wish you guys a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year when it come. And thanks for visiting the channel. Thanks for my thumbs up. Thanks for my comments. We are getting to going into, almost going into a new year. So I thank you and may God bless you and may God keep you and let his face shine upon you and give you his peace. So we are going to make this macaroni and cheese now. Add half teaspoon of salt to the water and add one pack of macaroni. Place a pack of macaroni, elbow, I use elbow. So I'm just using one box. And, and just stir it around so it don't stick. And just let that boil until you don't have to boil it al dente. I like it cooked. So just cook it. I have cheese here. Lots of different cheese. I have Velveeta. I have Gouda cheese. I have cheddar cheese. More than one cheddar cheese. One, two, three different cheddar cheese. And I have Gouda and I have Velveeta. I think I said Velveeta already. But you, this is cheese i'm gonna grate the cheese the velvet i'm just gonna cut it in blocks little blocks in squares but the, these cheese i'm gonna grate them some is to go on the top of the macaroni and some is to go inside of the macaroni but you can buy the package of cheese that it already grated at the store but i'm gonna grate this and the the great the one that you grate is best now that the macaroni is cooked for eight minutes so cook the macaroni according to the direction on the package now that it's cooked for eight minutes I'm gonna strain the water off now that the cheese is all grated this I'm gonna put on the top of it and these are all grated to put inside the macaroni now that the cheese is all grated I'm gonna put the I'm gonna make a roux so I'm gonna put the butter to melt just melt the butter Adding some flour, flour to make the roux. So I'm adding flour. So I'm gonna make the flour thicken up a little bit, cook a little bit, but I'm adding some flour to make the roux. And it's on low, low heat, low, low heat. It's on very low, making the roux. Adding your milk. So you're gonna add your milk. So I'm adding three tins of evaporated milk. You can use any type of milk you like, whole milk, heavy cream, anything you wanna add, you could add it to it. At this time, you can add some white black pepper if you like black pepper. You can add mustard or you can add anato. Anato is a jume, it's a product. Anato, you can use anato. You can use, you can add black pepper you can add mustard, you can add annatto. But I'm gonna add some annatto. Annatto is what make the color of cheese. So you can add some annatto to it. Like about a teaspoon of annatto. You can add it to your mac and cheese. Annatto, black pepper, and mustard is optional to your mac and cheese. Add in the cheese. And this is vel Velveeta. I just cut them in squares. So I'm adding the Velveeta. And I'm just melting the cheese to put in the macaroni. Right 
and you just mix. Because the annatto is what gives trees its color. Look how beautiful this is. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. So I'm just going to pour it in the macaroni. And just mix as you pour. You just mix it in. As you pour, just mix it in. So you just pour this cheese sauce to the macaroni and then just bake for an hour not an hour 30 minutes just bake for 30 minutes I'm just gonna bake this for 30 minutes add the cheese to the top of the macaroni so I'm just gonna add some cheese on top And place it in the oven at 350 degrees for 30 minutes. There you have it family, your macaroni and cheese. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. And hit that notification bell for all my upcoming video family. Happy holidays. Love you. Wish you all the best. Bye.